Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. How are you, man? Bienvenido, teacher. Welcome, welcome, teacher. Welcome, teacher. I know phone. <clears throat> Excellent. Excellent. So, good evening. Good evening. Hey, welcome. Good to see you again. Thank you, my friend. Good to see you too. How was your day? Uh, a little bit hard, but a little bit busy. No, right. But I can with. You know, it's every day is routine, right? Yeah, every day is routine. Very good. Excellent. So, I can also say good evening to Mr. Iglesias, Magdalena, and Mr. Martinez. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, Magdalena? I'm fine, thing. I, I see working. Oh, you're still working. I see. Okay. I happy my work. Mm -hmm. Good okay. evening, teacher. Good evening, my friend. How are you? Driving, teacher. Llegando. Okay. Cool. Right on time to participate. Okay. There you go. <laughs> okay, so we will see here. Mr. David, what a surprise. Hello, my friend. Good evening, teacher. How are you? How are you? Good, good, and you? <laughs> Great. Very okay. well. So let's see. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right. So we are just going to give one more minute to wait for the rest to join the class and then we can start. Oh, okay, yeah, everybody, officially 8 o'clock. All right, so we are going to start right now with the class. Let's just start right now with the first activity here. You know, as every single night, I like to um, have a tongue twister. So in order for you to start practicing, right, and develop your fluency in pronunciation and intonation at the same time, right? So let's just go and see what's the uh, tongue twister for today. Okay, so let's see. Okay, take a look at this one. It says this. Well, let me just go word by word so you can see it and know how to pronounce it, right? It's going to be like, how many snacks cool a snack stalker stuck? If a snack stalker snapped, stocked snacks. All right, excellent. So now let me see. Let me go here with the uh, pronunciation again all right so let's see the next one it says there how many snacks one more time all right how many snacks cool ah uh, very good stalker stalker right so which is this word how many snacks cool how many snacks stalker stuck if a snack stalker, snack stock snacks. Snacks. Stock snacks. There you go. Excellent. So I will go again for this one. So pay attention here one more time. All right. It says here how many oh. snacks pulled a snack stalker stock if a snack stalker snack. Stuck snacks. There you go. Excellent. Now, with the pronunciation, everybody, now just practice. I will give you here 
two minutes, all right? I'm going to free to practice because I know it's a little bit harder. So remember, practice, pronounce it, pronounce it, pronounce it, and pronounce it until you memorize it. After two minutes, I am going to select some volunteers right here. So let's see. Go ahead, my friends. Two minutes starting now. Continue, please. Let's continue, continue. If you need my help, right, with those um, words in the pronunciation, please let me know so I can help you with that. Let's see, let's see, let's see. How many snacks? Cool oh, snacks, stalker stock. If a snack, stalker, snack, stock, scots. <laughs> oh, All right, practice, stack, practice, pronounce it, pronounce it, pronounce it. Really, 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 really. Stack, stack, if a snack, stacker, is snacker, stack, is snacks. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. Excellent, 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 excellent. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very good. One more minute, one more minute, one more minute, one more minute, one more minute. There you go. Excellent. How many snacks? Cool snacks, doctor. All right. Yes. How many snacks? Cool snacks, stocker stock. If a snack, stocker stock, stock snacks. Yes, Magdalena, tell me. Is that a stock? This one right here, it's a stocker. This stocker. It's stocker. This one, right? Yeah, it's stocker. All right. Very good. Very good. Is that second? How many snacks? Cool as la voy a decir a ver si me corrige. Excellent, it, because it's already time for you to practice it, all right? So, yes, 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 go ahead. Tell me, go ahead, Magdalena. How many snacks full snack stocker stack if, if a snack stocker snacker stocker snack? Es stack okay, teacher or stocker? The stock or stock? No, this is a stock. Stocker, stock. Stock. This one. Take a look. Repeat it with me. Stocker. Stocker, stocker. And this is a stock. All right. Understand? Okay, who's next? Next, 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 next. Okay, time's uh -huh. up. Oh, okay. Come All on. right. Who's my volunteer? Mr. Iglesias, go ahead. Uh, how many is a snack cool? A uh, snack sticker stuck if a snack sticker snack snacker is sticker snack. Snack. Very good. Excellent. So that's nice. That's nice. You were doing good. All right. So no worries. You did good on this one. I know it's hard. This is a hard one, right? So, but yeah, you were doing it good. So now let's continue with the next one. Thank you, Mr. Iglesias. So who is going to be the next volunteer? Me, teacher. Who's my next volunteer? Thank you, Edmundo. Go ahead, my friend, please. How many snack could a snack a stalker stack? If a snack a stalker snacked is Stacked snacks. There you go. Excellent. Thank you. It's specifically because these words are very similar, right? So the difference in the words is, for example, the letter T. So in the you have the letter N. So this is a stock and this is a snacks. All right. So that's basically the difference. But thank you, Muno. You did a very good job. So I have Maria, Mr. Iglesias, and El Mundo participating. Who's next? Mm -hmm. Who's the next one? Yes, my friends. Next volunteers. Tell me, tell me, please. Me, teacher. 
All right, very good. Ever, Enrique, go ahead, my friend. Tell me. Hogman is not cool as not. Stacker is not. Is a snack stacker. Snack stack is not. Hey, good job. All right, so. Ever, forever. <laughs> very good, Ever. That, that was actually a very nice job, by the way. All right, so. Um, well, excellent. Thank you, my friend. Good job. So who's the next one? Next one. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Thank you, Mr. Rosales. Please continue. Okay, teacher. How many snacks? Cool, I snack, stalker, spike. If I snack, stalker. Snack, stack, snacks. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Oh, my goodness, my friends. That was actually a difficult one, and now everybody's doing it super nice. All right. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Do I have more volunteers? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Next, 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 next. Uh huh. Yes. Who's my next volunteer? Come on, one more, one more, one more. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh -huh. Let me next teacher. One, who, 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 who was that one? Who was that one? Wilbur. Yes. Hello, Wilbur. Good, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? I'm pretty good, my friend. What about yourself? I'm fine here, ready. Awesome, <laughs> awesome. Go ahead. Continue. In okay. Practice, oh, money snack. Cool a snack. A taker snack. A stack. If a snack. A stacker snack is tech. A snack. Chample. All right. Very good. Excellent. So no worries. That was actually good. So thank, thank you very much for participating. Thank you. Okay, everybody, we are going to stop right here. All right. So with that activity, so thank you very much for participating. Uh, let me congratulate you because, you know, this tongue twister is actually a hard one and you were doing it correctly. Right. So super nice job. So now let's just continue here with the next activity for today. Today, today. Let's see. Tonight, actually. All right. So, well, 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 well. Yeah. Do you remember last night we were talking about wishes? Remember that? All yeah. right. So, we were actually saying, um, hello, Mr. Santos. We were saying, like, I wish to have this one, me gustaría, ojalá, etc. Right. So, then we have six situations here, six situations, and we are going to like express our wish. All right. So, let me help you with number one. Number one here, it says it's winter, right? So, and it's winter, and it will be here. How do you say this one? You know, the fact or el hecho es que it's winter. No nos gusta el invierno. Okay, so, entonces, podríamos decir muchas cosas. Ojalá fuera verano, ojalá estuviera en otro país, ojalá estuviera en Hawaii, etc. Right? So, what will be here, the best option here? Uh -huh. Tell me, what is it? I wish it is where... Summer. Aha, uh -huh, exactly, right? So that will be, I wish. It were. It were summer. So yeah, it I were wish okay. it were. It were summer. Summer. Very good job. Excellent. Thank you very much. That's actually correct. What about the next one? Okay, let's just get some vocabulary here, my friends, right? Vocabulary, vocabulary. It, and we have here the word ill. Repeat, my friends, ill. Ill. Thank you very much. And what's the meaning of ill? Enfermo. Enfermo, like sick. Exactly. All right. So then, what will be like the wish you will have right here, my friends? I wish I were. I wish I were. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It could be negative. Because remember, if you are ill and you don't want to be ill, so I wish I were. I were. We're not. There you go. I were, were not. not. Ill. 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 Exactly. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Because you're saying like, soy enfermo y ojalá no estuviera enfermo. Right. So I wish I were not ill. Very good job. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So let's go with the next one right here. So it has here. Oh, it says, I can't afford to go on a holiday. Hey, guys, do you remember the meaning of afford? What is afford? Person. 
Esfuerzo. Excuse me. Esfuerzo, no. No, that's effort. effort. Ah, effort. Right. So yes. like effort. That like afford it's to have the ability to pay for something. Oh yeah. Thank you. you. Know, like for example, I cannot buy an iPhone because I cannot afford it. So it means I don't have money to buy it. I don't I have to. I don't have money to go and holler. Exactly. Okay. So afford it it's, it's, to have uh -huh. the money to buy something. Yeah. Right. So I wish. Uh -huh. I wish. I have money. For example, I. I wish. I have. I I had money. Money. All right. So yes, that is also correct. Very good. Excellent. So. Right. No puedo pagar, no puedo, ya, no puedo costearme, actually, una vacación, so ojalá tuviera dinero. All right, so baby, number I four. I can drive. I can't drive. So what's no next one? No puedo manejar. How do you say, I, like, the opposite in a wish? I wish, me gustaría, mm -hmm. eh, can poder, que, poder. No, 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 I, 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 I. Porque es negro. I draw. I draw. Uh, I draw. Could be that one. Could be that one. It can definitely be this one. Eh, yeah. El mundo oh, se puede ser I draw. Because it's in class. O también podríamos decir, siempre usando un mother bird, we can use a mother bird. I could. Ajá, uh -huh, exactly. I could, I could drive. I could dr drive. Yeah. Exactly. Right. So, but uh, I just want to clarify, El mundo, that the way you were saying it, it's also correct. Okay. Yeah. All right, very okay. good. So I can swim. Same situation here. Very similar to the previous one, yeah, right? I, I, I wish uh, I, I swam. I, I swam. We can have it like this one here. Or uh, I wish. Say, I wish I could, or I could swim. Okay. Very good. Excellent. So it's the same thing here. All right. So like the same you have here. I wish I drive. I drop, right? If you want to just have it like this one. There you go. Excellent. So then uh, the last one here, which is number six, it refers to this one. My laptop, it's broken. All right. So what is it? I wish uh, I had a new one. For example. All right. So I wish. Go like this one. I wish. Oh, one second. I wish I had a new one. A new one, all right. So there you go. Excellent. So, guys, mm -hmm. let me tell you that those answers were also super good, correct. Okay, now let's just work on something. Let's just change the color and tell me another wish. All right. So for each uh, sentence or for each situation there. So for example, we let's go back to number one. It says it's winter. I wish it were summer. Que otro wish se les ocurre para number one? Mm -hmm. I wish uh, I were at the beach. Uh -huh. I were at the beach. Oops. I were at the beach. All right. So I wish I were at the beach. Thank you very much. So you had that one over there. All right. Very good. Excellent. What about this one? So we need another one here. What is it? What will be that one, my friends? Let's see, let's see. Mm -hmm. I, I wish I could. Mm -hmm. I wish I could. Yeah. I wish cool. Mm -hmm. sure. so that would be like this one. I wish I could, for example, feel better. Better. Uh -huh. Exactly. So I wish I could feel better. Sería poder sentirme ojalá si me sintiera mejor. All right, so this one right here will be another another one here. So what will that be? Mm -hmm. I wish I can. Mm -hmm. Le dijimos, ojalá tuviera dinero, pero like, what will be like that one? Another one. Mm 
Yes. Yes, I wish. Why do you do this one? I wish. I pull. Uh -huh. My God. <laughs> All right, I pull. Have. Have. Enough money. Like similar to the first one. Yeah. There you go. I wish I could have enough money. All right, this one, we already have another one. Let's go with the last one right here, all right? So the mm. last one, it says, my laptop is broken. Ya dijimos, I wish you have a new one. What will be the next one? Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Mm. So we'll be like, I wish, uh-huh. I could buy a new one. I could, I could right. buy. So basically, similar oh. to the first one. Uh, teacher, I could uh -huh. buy. No, because remember, when you have, si ya tenemos aquí cool, este es mi pasado. Right? Okay. All right, so like this one. So, for example, aquí no tengo un model verb. Entonces, por eso no solamente ponemos had. Pero en el sentence número 3, I wish I could oh, have. Oh, yeah. This one, yeah. I, it was my mistake. I'm so sorry. It's supposed to be have. Thank yeah, you for yeah. the observation. All right. So it's supposed to be have here. Oh. Like that. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the observation, my friend. All right. Excellent. Thank you. Hey, guys. Do you have any questions regarding this? It's okay, Edith, no problem. All right, so thank you, thank you. All right, well, let's just eliminate everything right here and let's just go to the first activity here, all right? So let's see. Okay, everybody, pay attention to this part right here. We are going to be talking about food, 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 food. Imagine how delicious, all right? So. And if you pay attention right here, it's just this one, what it says, all right, it, the, the top 100 most popular dishes in the world, right? The taste atlas, all right? So that's what happens right here, all right? So let's see here, one quick second, one, give me one quick second. I'm just going to like, I do apologize for that inconvenience. I was just uh, making sure I was in a silence place. Sorry. All right. So let's see. Let's talk about this one. Imagine, of course, you know, out of the 100 most popular dishes in the world, eh, we have been, we have selected like the top 10 from Latin America, right? And guess who is in number one? Number one, number one. Pay attention to number one. What's the number one dish, people? Yes, yes, yes. Remember. Pupusas. Exactly, right? So we got this uh, one right uh, here. Pupusa. Yay. So remember the word dish. One second. All right. The word dish. Dish, 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 dish. What is dish, my friends? What is dish? Pl platos. Uh -huh, plato, or in this case, un platillo, all right? Platillo, so we're talking about yeah. food, yes. Yeah. All right, so it says like that the, one of the most popular here, it's going to be pupusas, right? Imagine in El Salvador, we have one of the most popular dishes in the world, right? And, well, you have to accept that pupusas are delicious, yes or no? Yes, yes. are delicious. Right, so, of but course. in... Uh, the top 10 we have right here, we not, uh, we don't only have uh, pupusas, we also have different dishes from uh, Latin American countries. And I just want to ask you if you have tried uh, any of them before. Let's see, number two, it says, which is asado. What's the asado? Basically, you know, there is no translation into English for that. Asado is asado because it's the myth. name of the dish. Myth. But you know it is beef. Exactly, right? Okay, it is beef for me some in the grill. Yeah. All right. Beef. 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 Exactly, right? So, which is going to be like this one right here. 
So it's beef. What is beef? Carne. Carne. But the rest. All right. So let's go this one. All right. Pork. So uh, like the beef, carne de res, of course. All right. So which is it's delicious. You know, Argentinian people, they love uh, beef and they prepare like the best asados in the world. Right. So like that. And, you know, when they talk about asados, they're talking about big portions of beef. Right. So it's not only about like the um, the portions we have here in El Salvador. All right. So then number three, it says machas a la parmesana. Have you ever tried that, people? Never have you ever I never seen tried that? it. I never All tried right. it. Do you know it, how they do? I, I don't know what is much a la parmesana. Okay, no worries. I have some pictures here so you can see them. All right. So we have here it says eh, machas a la parmesana. There you go. Excellent. So this one it's let me see. Okay. Do you see this one, my friends? We will see the screen right now. One second. All right. Do you see it? Yes, I see it. Does it look delicious to Maybe you? Maybe seafood. Maybe. It looks like seafood. Yeah. Yes, it looks delicious. delicious. It looks delicious. Yes, uh, what's like the resana? Uh, ah, it says here it's seafood. Yes. yes, it's seafood, seafood, seafood. That seafood, is seafood. a club. Right. Very good. So yes, yes. So it's delicious, delicious, delicious. All right. So then we have the next one, the number four. What is this one? It will be cochinita pibil. What is I this one? Pibil. Teacher. What is hmm? cochinita? Teacher, teacher. Uh, uh, yep. in my town, uh, we 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 eat cochinita, but it's a uh, the pork hell bacon. Only the the Sunday, right? So it's just like this one. So that's how we call it here in El Salvador. Yes, in, in, just in my town, Atikisaya. Cochinita. Oh, yes, my friend, but in Atikisaya they prepared a festival about pork food. I mean pork meat. Yeah, right? There is a festival of the cochinita. Yes, you know but what? Is that, I... It's a pork pork hell bacon. Uh huh. Right. So I was there this year. It was like what in October, September, October, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. September. I was there this year and I enjoyed it. So it's like long lines, you know, to queue to wait for that one. So yes, and that was delicious, right? So yes, take so. a look. It's just basically meat, all right? So pork, 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 pork. It, right? Just pork is the, the, the pork hell. All right. Exactly. So that's it. Take a look. Yeah. Right. It's pork, pork, pork. All right. Do you like pork, people? Because some people don't like pork. Yes, I like, I like pork. I eat pork. Yes. So uh, I it would be uh, for you. I, I, you don't mm. like pork. <laughs> All right. So let's see. That's the first one. Then you go on the next one right here. Which is this one? Um, you know the number five here in uh, Brazil. It's going to be the picanha. All right. Have you ever tried picanha? Uh, I know. I, I, I never tried picanha. I ne tried I one? no listen. All right. So well, la picanha. It's basically beef. Also, beef. So like a, a asado. You know, so oh, it, just, a, just a beef. Yeah, it, it's it's just like basically. Uh, um, I don't. Um. Uh, well. Um. Como like like el muslo de la vaca, you know. That's actually la picaña, right? Es. Piche uh, carne de ternera, okay. Aha! Uh -huh, exactly. You know, from the back part, from the back part of the like that one. That's exactly right. Okay. Yes. So it's just like that one. All right. It, well, you know what? I guess here in El Salvador we eat it. Pero creo que aquí es el el um how do you call it? Solomo. 
That's how you totally call it here in El Salvador. All right. So, all right. Excellent. So, have you tried that before, people? I've never tried. Oh, come on. It's very common. All right. So, what about number seven, chilaquiles? Have you tried Mexican chilaquiles? Six, six, six chilaquiles. Uh -huh. So, have yes. you ever tried that one? Yes. yes. What are chilaquiles? Can you describe it, Edmundo? What are they? Yes, it's a tortilla with uh, something in the middle. Yes, algo picoso. Yeah, yes. exactly. So it's just like tortillas with avocado, no. cheese, any beef. type of meat, right? So beans. It can be chicken, it can be beef, beans. it can be pork. Beans. Whatever. Sure. Which one? Beans. Beans, ah, yes, beans, special sauces, yeah, sauce. all right? Yeah. Like the chilaquiles ones. Yeah, that's right. Then uh, from Puerto Rico, take a look to that one, Puerto Rico. The arroz Puerto Rico. con gandules. You know what is el arroz con gandules? No, I've never heard before. All right. So, el arroz con gandules, it's just basically, I will just show you right now. All right. So, we eat it here in El Salvador. So, lo que le llamamos like a different way. Um, <laughs> it's in El Salvador, you know, tiene otro significado esta, esta, esta dish. It has a different meaning. It's basically rice, all right? So rice, 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 and pork. Mm. Paella. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. No, because paella has seafood. Seafood with uh, rice. Rice, uh -huh. this one is just a uh, rice and pork. Pork. Pork, pork, pork. All right. So, exactly. Rice and pork. <laughs> so, this one is basically what you can see here is pork. Yes, it's what you're imagining. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right. So, why are you laughing? <laughs> My All right. <laughs> gandula, arroz con gandule. <laughs> Los gandules, all right. Oh my goodness. All right, excellent. So, well, number eight from Brazil also, Alcatra, right? So, what is it? Do you know it? Have you heard yeah. about that one? No. What I is it? Hear it's about before. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Alcatra, it's also a beef. You know what? It's como like, uh, we call it here in El Salvador, eh, carne guisada. Pero tiene que ser de lomo. Have you ever tried that? Mm -hmm. All right, so it's just, I, I will show you right now so you can see it. No worries. Mm -hmm. Do you see it now? Not yet? Not yet, yeah. Right now, there yes. Okay, so that's it. It's beef. All right, so, uh, and it's normally, you know, as you can see it right here. All right, so it's just like... Giso, giso. Of course. Mm -hmm. Giso, beef is exactly. true. It's true, it's true. All right, awesome. So let's just continue with this one right here. El pan de bono. What's el pan de bono from Colombia? Mm-hmm. I don't know. All right, excellent. So, el pan de bono from Colombia. I'm going to show you right now here. It's just like it, what we call here pan francés. Yeah. You know, it's exactly that one. Is, uh, in Mexico, they call it bolillos, which is el pan redondo, right? Uh, it's just like that one. You will see it. Pan de bono, todos el bolillo, el pan redondo. Buñuelos, some people call it like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, do you see it? It's bread. Yes. Bread. Just simple bread. And the last one, the last one was, let me see here, uh, lechona from Colombia as well. All right. So, let's see. Mira okay. la lechona. What is it right here? And that's it. It's also pork. You will see it in a moment. 
We see it. The roster, roster pork. Mm -hmm. it, that, I guess this is the one you were saying before, right? No. Yeah, but it's, it's in, like, the, in the in the no. case of the cochinita, it's just the the hell, the hell, the pork. The head. All right, this one is the whole pork, right? So All the pork. Yes. We're going to have it right here, and it's just like that one. All right, so it's just like lechon. What we call the lechon here? Yes, <laughs> right. yes, 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 mm -hmm. Yes, of course you have to say I am from a tiki All right, it's so. delicious. It's delicious. A Lucha también le gusta ahí acompañarlo con arroz. Ah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Chinita, arroz, con, arroz, arroz con gandules. <laughs> All right. Funny. Rice. Candle. 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 With rice. All right, excellent. Thank you very much. So now, everybody, let's just have a, a, a short conversation right here about the food. We were talking about 10 different dishes. And now I would like you to tell me, like, have you ever tried any of these dishes before? And Mr. Iglesias is speaking with the microphone open. All right. So there you go. Excellent. Thank you. All right. So Everybody here, have you ever tried any of these dishes before? Or if you haven't, which one would you like to try? Which one would you like to eat? Mm -hmm. So remember, like for example here, which one would you like to try? Have you tried any of this one? All right. Like this one? Uh, I, I, have would, I, would, I would like to try with lechona. Lechona, all right. Yes, because you like pork, all right? So to begin, to give more details, Mr. Um, Edmundo, so you can say like, I would like to try lechona because I like pork, for example, all right? To give yes. a longer answer. I will, I will like to, again? Yes, I would like to try lechona because I like, I like the pork. Okay, very good, excellent, thank you. Have you tried any of those dishes before? I never tried before. No, any of them? What about... No, no right about now? Lechona? No. no like, the... From the ones we saw before, like from the whole list? Yes. Which ones have you tried? Mm -hmm. Which ones have you tried? Have you tried, of course, pupusas because we're Salvadorians, right? Uh -huh. what yes. Else? Have you tried cochinita, Pibil? Uh, yeah, I would like to try all right, asados, but the Argentina. Yes, ones, too. Right? Also, very good, excellent. So, there you go. Let's see, Magdalena, tell me, what of those wish, I mean, dishes would you like to try? Mucha interferencia. Yes, we we'll close it. Don't worry. Uh -huh. Well, Mr. Eh, Perez, Enrique Perez, which one would you like to try? Which one would you like to eat? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which one would you like to try? Yes, eso es la cual le gustaría eh, probar. Um, pues en El Salvador. You can answer like this one. Uh, one second. It will be like this. I, I would like to try. And then me dice the name of the dish. Primero me dice, I would like to try. Luego me dice el nombre de platillo, right? The, the, the name of the dish. I would like I, to try. I, I would like to try. Uh, uh, platillo del Salvador de otro país, teacher. De los que vimos ahorita, my friend, please. Oh, um, ¿Cómo le llaman la primera, el de Brasil? Um, I can show you no problem. Picaña, picaña. Va a ser picaña, cabal. A picaña, all right, to try picaña. All right, picaña, very good, excellent. Uh, picaña, uh, 
de, de Brasil. Va, eh, from, tan... from Brasil. From Brasil. There you go. Thank you, Mr. Uh, let's see this one. Mr. Rivera, Ellen Nielsen, tell me, my friend, which one would you like to try? I would like to try uh, Chilaquilas from Mexico. Ah, yes. That's actually right. Chilaquilas. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Uh -huh. Mr. Iglesias, which one would you like to try? Uh -huh. Mr. Iglesias is not here. All right, Wilder. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. which, I, which would you like to try? I would like to try. Um, uh, que parece concha, se, se me olvida ahí el nombre. Uh, that is going to be. Uh, machas. Machas. A la machas. A la parmesana. I will uh -huh. like. Uh, Matches. I, like I, like I would like to try matches a la parmesana. There we go. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Like to try pan de bono. Pan de bono. Yeah, but mm -hmm. you can go right now. Like... Cachito de bono. <laughs> un cachito, right? Or un pan All right. So, very good. Excellent. Thank you very much. That's nice. All right. Sure. Okay. Yes, my friend. Tell me. I, I would like to try cochinita pibil. Cochinita pibil. Oh, yes. That would be delicious. Of course. Right? So. Okay. Delicious. Yes, yes, yes. Excellent. So let's go now with the question number two. It says, what other ethic food, when you say like ethic food people right here, I'm sorry, it's not ethic. It's ethnic. I'm sorry. What other ethnic food can you try in your city? Okay, so we all are Salvadorians, right? Besides pupusas, what else can we eat here in El Salvador? Tam what else? Tamales de pescado. <laughs> Tamales de what? Really? Ah, uh, yeah, teacher. In San Pedro, Perulapan. My God, I have never heard about that before. <laughs> I like tamales de, de, fi de fish. No, no. All right. Yeah. Well, my camera was off and you didn't tell me anything. I'm so sorry I didn't notice that before. All right, so. Oh, really? Any food, uh, about any food, uh, maybe uh, come callos. <laughs> Do you mean like those are pepescas? Uh, like, like, like that. Similar. Similar, yes. Este el agua y lo pongo. Ejotes. Ejotes. Teacher, son grandes. Ejotes. Ok, that's interesting. Oh my lo invito, God. Lo invito a San Pedro, pero la pantis. Awesome. There are those, all right? So we have two invitations from Magdalena yeah. people. So we have to go to Magdalena's town to eat that delicious, to try those ta uh, fish tamales, of course, <laughs> right? Okay. Okay, great. Excellent. So now. Let's see. Um, well, you mentioned tamales, like fish tamales. You have mentioned the pescas, which is a fish. Um, what else can we eat here in San Salvador? Mm -hmm. Chicha. Uh -huh. Chicha. 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 Right. <laughs> it's true. It's true. It's true. All right. All right. Very good. Excellent. So if you have the opportunity to go to Los Planes besides pupusas, what else can you eat at Los Planes? Mm -hmm. Riwas. Sob de ham. Sob de ham, teacher. Which one? Sob de ham. You mean, I, I understood that, you know, is that right? Hen? Yeah. Oh, ham soup, you mean? Ham soup. All right, or oh, chicken soup, if you want to call it like that. Chicken, chicken hand soup. There you go. Oh, yeah, hand soup. delicious. Delicious, delicious. Yes, Ellen Nielsen, tell me. Um, in Edmund in Nahuizalco, uh -huh. uh -huh. some pop of May. Hmm? What? Nah, you're kidding. Yeah. No way. Really, Mr. Baudi? Yeah. 
Are they delicious? Son poco yeah. la parte de la <laughs> All right. Oh my goodness. I have never tried that one, right? So, but that is obviously something that it happens in May, right? Yes, that doesn't happen any other time of the year. Okay, very good. Uh, we were been talking about that one. You know, since El Salvador, it's a very small country, you know, the same dishes are popular in most of the cities. But imagine eating some popos de mayo for now. Oh my goodness. How do you prepare them? Are they fried? You know, fried like fritos? Uh huh. Are they fried? Yeah, fried. All right. And do you add something to cook it? Uh, like any sauce or anything? Salt, whatever? Salt and mantequilla. Or Butter. Butter. Butter, yeah. And is uh is a special with uh, tacos. Tacos of so popos? Yeah. Ah oh my god. All right, so interesting. It's the first Did time you, I yeah. Have you ever tried with the crab with uh with alguaste? Which one? Have you ever tried crabs with the guaste? Yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. It's a good yes. one. We call it here punches, right? Yeah, punches, yes. Yes, of course. That's our delicious, right? Delicious, delicious. Oh, or can I call it? Snail. Snail? Snail. Mm, Snail. No, I never tried that one. I have tried rabbit. You know what is rabbit? Yeah. It's sure. Right, so snake. Uh, well, once in Huayua. Right, just once. So, just once. Also duck. All right. That's also delicious. Like that's actually something I have tried. Right, like duck. Uh, no. tamales, for example. Oh. In Huayua, snake frog. You know, I I saw it. But I didn't want to eat it. Uh -uh. Yeah, all right, right. Do you like it? Do you eat those things? Oh my goodness. Are they delicious? It's a special uh, chicken. It's like chicken. Yeah. My the God. flower is, is with is, it's, uh, a chicken. It tastes like chicken. All right. Imagine, I didn't know about that. Oh my goodness. All right. So, well, thank you. So, in, uh, let's see this one. Let's continue with the next activity here. Oh my goodness, people. Tonight's topic is very interesting. Okay. Well, everybody here now, we will have the opportunity to go to the breakout rooms. So, we will have conversations to talk about simple past. All right. Please, everybody, pay attention because you are going to go to the breakout rooms and you're going to have conversations about this one right here. All right, so questions in past, like the first one. All right, what did you have for breakfast this morning? Which it means? What is it into Spanish? ¿Qué desayunaste esta And then you have to say, in past, I ate pupusas, I ate, um, you know, cheese, beans, I drank coffee, etc. right? Yeah. Exactly. So the second question right here, all right? What was the last film you saw? All right, so what was the last? Remember the film is the same as movies. All right, so the last movie I saw, it was Spider-Man, Titanic, uh, Jurassic Park. What, Raven? Or, oh, that's a nice one. All right, so then you go and take this one right here. Who did you last talk on the phone? All right, so what's this one? Who was the last person you had a phone call with? Okay. And this one, what did you last read? You can say, for example, here, I uh, read, for example, you can say here, I read the news. For example, this one, it was Titanic. 
right? So I call my mom. I call my mom. I had pupusas for breakfast. I had pupusas. Okay, very good. And then you go on the next side right here. What she says here, what was the last photograph you took? All right, so la ultima photo that you actually took here, it was, for example, you can say it like, it was a photo of my, of the lens of the, I don't know, the sunset. Una foto del atardecer, of sunset. All right, so in the next one, when did you last see the sea, All right? ¿Cuándo fue la última vez que viste el? Mar, very good, All right? So it's a, it was two years ago. Very good, excellent, all right? What did you buy yesterday? I bought, the compramos, right? I bought a cell phone, for example, all right? And last one right here, what was the last meal you cooked? ¿Qué fue el último qué? What is it? What is meal? Comida. Comida, very good. So, so what was the last meal you cooked? All right, I cooked, you can say like this one. I you cook. cooked chicken. Beans. For example, chicken beans, depending on you, right? Very good. Understand the activity, my friends? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Excellent. So, uh, Mr. Martinez, maybe you can take an inspiration with these examples and send it to the group. So, when you go to the breakout rooms, so you will have these examples, okay? Yes. Thank you very much. Let's just go to the breakout rooms right now, my friends. Let's see. I just share it, teacher. You share it? Yes. All right, cool. Share it. Yeah. Bye -bye. Let's see. Very good, excellent. So everybody, please access to the rooms so you can see there mm -hmm. and practice. Please go ahead. Access to the break rooms, my friends. Okay, very good. Rollins to join the um the room, Mr. Martinez. Mr. Iglesias, everything okay? Any problems for acceder al room? Excellent. Okay. Este, what was the last thing you saw? You saw. So. 
so. Uh, what is it so? Bispe. It, it was um, uh, Spider oh, the movie. Okay. Movie. I am este. I am look on the uh, the sweet. Uh, no, uh, sweet, sweet. Los sueños parece que es una de una nueva de de Disney. No. Mm. Sí. I don't, I don't know. What's the name in Spanish? Es eh, de un pueblito donde la gente le entrega los sueños al rey y el rey tiene magia y los él elige qué sueños se hacen realidad y cuáles no. Entonces, Sweet creo que se llama. Ok. Freak, then. I am Lucas Pica Piedra, only. I watched, I watched. I was, I was. The field stones. Teacher, uh -huh. one yeah. question. What yeah. is the uh, difference entre look and watch? And watch? Watch, it's just when you are actually paying full attention to something. Oh. Like, for example, when you're watching a movie, a video, or something, uh -huh. right? So you're paying yeah. full attention. And look, it's a it's watch. Like, like uh, for example, what I just, I, I just want you to, to look at something, but that's it. No more attention, right? So you see, like, for example, if I want to say, like, hey, Wilbur, look at that girl. So you are just going to see that girl, and that's it. No more, right? Understand? Yeah, yeah. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank right. you. One more, Miss Cedillo. One more. Yeah. Oh, same. Who did you last talk to on the cell phone? Mm -hmm. I called my 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 brother. I called uh, my brother. I, I called uh, my 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 how I say boyfriend. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, boyfriend. Yeah. Okay, nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. What did you last read? I read on the on I the read books and the, the, uh, the the training. Este revista teacher magazine. Magazine, I, I don't remember. Magazine, uh -huh. I like magazine. So, re remember, uh, guys, el, el verbo leer, it's the same in past and in present, but the pronunciation uh -huh. changes. In present, the pronunciation is read, but in past, uh, so the pronunciation read. is read. I read uh -huh. magazine in, in my días in libres. In my day off. In my day off. Friend. Mm -hmm. Okay, I am reading on the book on the training. Um, my time break. As you said, it. My break time. Break time. Break time. Break time. What did you buy yesterday? Mm -hmm. Um, I, uh, I bought with, um, 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 yeah, permítame. Only, only you do exercise. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. él, 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 él pasa solo haciendo ejercicio. Oh, really? Sí, este, es Wilber. Yes. <laughs> I am teacher on the uh, física. I am a, a, a well, how do you say, profesor de física o yes. entrenador? Es profesor de física. I am teach. Te, so, no, teach. Entonces, I am no. a sports teacher. A sport uh, teacher. I am a sport teacher. I am teacher. Uh, okay, I am a sport teacher. At the morning and the am... last. Mm. I 
Ajá. De Police. Yo soy este, este policía en instructor, pero es doctrina policial. Tendría que ser eh, I am police police teacher. Se fue el teacher. No, I'm here, I'm here. Eh, yo soy instructora, pero de doctrina policial. Doctrina is a um, um, credo, um, 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 referencia comport del comportamiento. Ok, so, entonces sería como like, um, um, mm. I'm checking like that, what would be the correct word here? Um, creo que sería like, like sería como... The police, like como the la, filosof police la filosofía de la policía, que es that yeah. piece, okay? So like the, um, I, I am an instructor of the police instructor philosophy. The police philosophy. Yeah. Yes. Philosophy. Thank you, teacher. What, what, the, what, what was the last meal you cooked? ¿Qué cocinas? ¿Qué cocina, amigo? Oh, um, I am cooking and my dinner is um, a fish, a binge, fish? and a uh, um, H. Ah, H. I'm um, dijo el teacher que dijéramos hem soap. Me dijo que hem soap dijo era, ¿verdad? Yes. Ay, me gusta hacer sopa de gallina. Y um, okay, tamales de pato. Dog hen, qué rico, delicious. Yeah. My friend Luchita. What? How are you, my my friend Magdalena? Thank you very much, everybody. So we're going to continue with this one right here. So we can finish the class, you know, because it's almost time. But before we finish it, we are going to review it. All right. Having here some uh, questions asking this one. So, for example, let's see. Mr. Martinez, tell me, what do you have for breakfast this morning? I, I, I had beans, uh, cheese, um, eggs, uh, coffee, and bread. Okay, very good. Excellent. Thank you very much. Magdalena, tell me, who did you uh who did you last talk on the phone? Um I I I calling hey, my boss my my boyfriend. Boyfriend <laughs> <laughs> with me, with me. <laughs> Ah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, oh. so. no, 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 <laughs> it's a All joke. Right. Excellent. So, Mr. Let's see who is available. Oh, Wilbur. So, tell me, uh, let's see this one. Um, what did you last read? I I read uh, the books of training. I read, I read, I read the book. Read the book and book? training. Training book about training. I, I training read the book. magazine. Teacher. With the magazine. Okay. That's I interesting like. in here. Uh, let's see. Ever tell me when what was the last movie you saw or you watched? Teacher. No questions. Teacher. Yes, my Sorry. friend, tell me. Then, um, I, I, I has a um, meeting in my world. Uh, That's fine. Actually, we are going to stop right here. All right, so no worries. You're going to stop right here. So I thank you very much for joining the class. See and you tomorrow, teacher. The activities. I will see you tomorrow. Hope you have a good night, everybody. Good night, sweet dreams. Oh, good night. Thank you. Likewise. Bye-bye.
Take care, teacher. See you Bye -bye. tomorrow. Take care, you yeah, too. Bye -bye. See you tomorrow.